sausage. That's okay. Pizza basic burger and fries. I didn't want to go wrong, I was hungry. <laughs> Can't relate. How's my food? It's fantastic, thank you. Is that actually? No. It's okay. It's okay. Because you cook it at home. Much better at home. Okay, tell the ladies. Ah! Much better. Single or taken? Huh? Single or taken? It's complicated. Oh, right, 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 right. So there's this ropes course, as you guys can see. But you need to have shoes and I'm not putting on someone else's shoes that they've used and getting Veruca's eel. Nope! There you sir. I didn't do that because you had to sign a waiver. Like, and that just seems so crazy to me. I will not be dying there, thank you. Or permanently paralyzed. Guys, these two rides, death. We were up there for an hour, up there. Deliberating with Carmen to go guys, she nearly cried. Apollo, you're watching this, yeah? She even said I can't believe I was forced Apollo to go on these rides. Guys, it was this pink ride, yeah. This blue ride, after you fully go down, it's not even that deep because it's literally like this and it just drops you. Like there's like a little door that just opens and you just fall. This one is painful guys. I felt like I needed to get stitches, like I like I just gave birth to a child. It was horrid. I hate it. I don't want to do it again. No. And there's a couple of those rides over there, they weren't too bad. These rides were lit, but you needed to have, oh, was it 200 kg? Yep. So we had to like wait for people because altogether me, Carmen and Chad are not 200 kg. So, but it was lit, it was lit, it was lit. So after that, we just basically chilled in the infinity pool because there was only half an hour left and we'd finished all the rides. But the thing that I'm pointing at is actually the first VR slide in Asia, the yellow thing. And I've never even been on a VR slide in a water park before. And the fact that it was closed actually really disheartened me because I was actually really excited to go on it. Hello! Ah! <laughs> How did you find the Chinese? It was okay, but... What did you get? Okay, how'd you find it? It was okay. Why it was, was it? Okay again. Really? Do you prefer the one in England? Definitely. Why? The only thing in, in Thailand I prefer that's done in England. Right, okay. Is there any reason why? Yeah, I don't know, it's just the taste really. There's a lot of chicken for me here. This is probably the last dragons I've ever had. <laughs> oh! <laughs> This is like one of this boat. We've come upstairs on a boat and we're kind of chilling in here. Which is really nice. I like if you see it from the front. Oh my god, my feet are hot. Eh, one night, one night, one night. If you see it from the front, it looks like this. I see a heart. I like this. But to fun, absolutely, but to fun. It looks like, look, it's an actual, like, Oh, what are they called? Mate, I'm not good at this boat language. Oh, oh my gosh, there's bean bags. Whatever's And then here's inside. It's so cute. I think I mostly like I like meeting people. <laughs> yeah, from all over the world. Oh, that is sad. 
the littlest one and that doesn't have an upstairs. So me and Carmen were kayaking. Chad actually stopped kayaking because he was scared of the water. We met this guy, he's actually originally from Wales, but he came to Thailand and has been living in Thailand for 16 years and he was literally saying how the UK. Guys, I wish I put my phone so you could hear what he was saying about the UK, but it was just so like refreshing to hear someone with UK blood born in the UK saying such negative stuff about the UK so that I know it's not just me. He was actually just like, it's bad vibes. Like, it's not good for young people. Da, 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 da. Like, it feels like the way they make other countries seem like, they make other countries seem so poor and like England is the best country to live in. And it's so good and true. Because it's literally like, when I came to Thailand, I thought it'd be like everyone on push bikes, this, that, the other. Then when I came, every, like, people are driving benches, all this and that. And I was actually thinking, do you know what? This is actually what England does, you know? It makes other countries seem like every other country is some next, I don't know, poverty, famine, stretched country, when it's not the case. You know what? He's made me realize I need to actually put a kick in my step. I'm gonna actually like try get out of this god forsaken land because it's not my future, it's not my destiny, it's not for me. Sorry, not for me. I know my Lord and Savior has better plans for me. He, he, he must. Guys, how do you find it? How do you find Thailand? Love Thailand. I actually what do you like that. Okay, so props to me, but the hotel that I picked. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. It's like no. No, that was that was really good. That was really that was really really good because you could have picked like a UK American style hotel, but you picked a Thailand style hotel, and I've never ever thought to do that before. And I feel like every time you go to a country, you should actually do that. Do you know what I mean, though? I understand. Yeah. I did it. Yeah. Well done, man. <laughs> That's never happened before. Yeah. Like it was proper like zen. Like no. Like it was so calming. There was a parrot that said hello at the front, probably due, due to abuse, but I had to you know put past that. But I don't think like we've had the same kind of like Thai experience that like other people have had, like with the party. One hundred percent. I just had a really good time. I can't lie to you. Nothing was stolen. Like our suitcases got hit. Didn't lose anything. We've actually we've actually had quite a smooth ride. We had like plans every single day normally get there vaguely on time i like the trip yeah it was quite good thailand was quite a nice country yeah as Carmen already said it just go quite smoothly and with all the activities that we had yeah um you know the roads were fine we got to learn a little bit about the history and the culture of thailand and um you yeah, got to meet some very interesting people you know and see how um, they live shout out ramona i feel like the elephant and the wildlife thing I really, really like that. To be honest, I liked a hell of a lot about Thailand. What would you want to change? We came in like kind of a badish season. Like it was a bit cloudy sometimes. Like mm. I feel like we didn't get the, the amount of sun that I need. Now, to be honest, there was always there was mostly always sun, but sometimes it was like cloudy sun. Sometimes it was raining. Like the other day we were in the pool and it was literally raining. Um, but it was still warm. Do you know what? The rain was cold, but everything else was warm yeah exactly like the weather it's not like it was like england rain do you know what i mean like i feel like even though it was raining the rain didn't affect me in any way shape or form it didn't dampen my mood yeah like it does in england the way i brought sun cream and i applied it did i even apply it once i applied it more in england <laughs> And the thing is, like, I've been trying to apply sun cream more right. since I've been learning yeah. about the importance of sun cream. I mean, 
I apply sun cream to my face every day because of the skin barrier. Because, you know, like, I was an acne sufferer. So now, obviously, like, I, I am an acne sufferer, recoverer. And obviously, yeah. Like, they are sponsored by. Yeah. So, like, it, it, so like I do wear sun cream from Cerebrum. Yeah, I like you. I'm not going to be an artist. <laughs> if we ate food like we did when we went on that cruise, shout out to Ying. Her, her food was the best Thai food I've ever had. It was, it was, I was, and the, right? I because, literally pay her. Right, because the Thai food we were paying for did not match up to the quality. No? It, 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 no? Even the fast food joints here. <laughs> Must more be said? <laughs> It's not that funny. Anyways, um, my apple pie is smaller than McDonald's. I got hash. Carmen gave me some hash browns with some onion ring. Oh. <laughs> Are you not gonna take? Oh, Thank you. You've got Fanta rock strawberry that tastes like Mento. <laughs> Wait, what? Really? Okay. I think the food we get to structure to our good holiday. Yeah, one hundred percent. You're right with that one. But on, in, Tonto, in some ways it was quite nice. Yeah. The mac chicken was different. <laughs> it was different, that's what I was saying. To be honest, it was a culture shock. Maybe that was it. It was a culture shock. <laughs> Maybe. No, it was a culture shock. Because indeed the food that we've grown up with. My poke. Thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you like, comment, subscribe and... Visit like... Okay guys, thank you for watching this video. I hope you like, comment, share and subscribe, you know, tell a friend to tell a friend and <laughs> see you on the next video.